A kapitiam or kopi tiam is a traditional coffee shop mostly found in Malaysia, Brunei, Singapore, and Indonesia patronized for meals and beverages. The word kopi is a Hokkien, Mandarin term for coffee cafe and tiam is the Hokkien, Hakka term for shop. Menus typically feature simple offerings, a variety of foods based on egg, toast, and kaya, plus coffee, tea, and milo. Topic Singapore Kopi TMs in Singapore are commonly found in almost all residential areas as well as some industrial and business districts in the country, numbering about 2,000 in total. Although most are an aggregate of small stalls or shops, some may be more reminiscent of food courts, although each stall has similar appearance and the same style of signage. In a typical kopi tiam, the drinks stall is usually run by the owner who sells coffee, tea, soft drinks, and other beverages as well as breakfast items like kaya toast, soft boiled eggs and snacks. The other stalls are leased by the owner to independent stallholders who prepare a variety of food dishes, often featuring the cuisine of Singapore. Traditional dishes from different ethnicities are usually available at Kapitiums so that people from different ethnic backgrounds and having different dietary habits could dine in a common place and even at a common table. Kapitium is also the name of a food court chain in Singapore. Some of the popular Kopi TMs in Singapore include Kim San Leng, Kalini, and Tong Ah Eating House or Ya Kun Kaya Toast. Some of the more common foods that can be seen in Kopi TMs, besides the ever popular eggs and toast, consist of char kwe tiao, fried flat rice noodles HOR fun sometimes cooked with eggs and cockles hockey and meat yellow wheat noodles served with various seafood as well as egg and possibly the most common nasi lemak or coconut rice a Malay dish of coconut flavored rice served with sambal chili paste egg and fried anchovies at kopi tiams Chinese cafe dian pinyin cafe dian literally coffee shop coffee and tea are usually ordered using a specific vernacular featuring terms from different languages Kopi coffee and teh tea can be tailored to suit the drinker's taste by using the following suffixes when ordering. Pung Chinese, bing pinyin, bing, pei, hog, pung, literally, ice, with ice, si, with evaporated milk, Hainanese dialect. Su dai, less sugar, hokchu, fuzhou dialect, o, black, no milk, kosong, nothing, no sugar, cow, extra thick, po, extra thin. These are typically chained together to customize a drink order. A kopi si kosong will result in a coffee with evaporated milk and no sugar. <laughs> Malaysia In Malaysia, as in Singapore, kapitiums are found almost everywhere. However, there are a few differences. In Malaysia, the term kapitium in Malaysia is usually referred specifically to Malaysian Chinese coffee shops. Food in a kapitium is usually exclusively Malaysian Chinese cuisine. Food courts and hawker centers are usually not referred to as kapitiums. Recently, a new breed of modern kapitiums have sprung up. The popularity of the old-fashioned outlets along with society's obsession with nostalgia and increasing affluence has led to the revival of these pseudo capitiums The new capitiums are fast food outlets which are reminiscent of the old capitiums in terms of décor, but are usually built in a more modern, hygienic setting such as a shopping mall rather than in the traditional shophouse, catering mainly for young adults. To offer the true kapitium experience, modern kapitiums mostly offer authentic local coffee brews, charcoal grilled toast served with butter and kaya a local version of jam made from coconut milk and eggs and soft boiled eggs. Some have extended menus where local breakfast, lunch and dinner meals are served. To tap into the sizable Muslim market, these kapitiums usually serve food that is halal permissible for consumption by Muslims unlike the traditional shophouse kapitiums. Today there are no less than 100 brand names of modern kapitiums operating in various parts of Malaysia. Kapitiums in Ipoh Altown district serve Ipoh white coffee. The coffee beans are roasted with palm oil margarine and with less sugar, resulting in a brew that is lighter in color than normal coffee beans that uses sugar, hence the name white coffee. Indonesia. <inaudible> 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 Kapitiums in Indonesia are very similar to those in Malaysia or Singapore. Originally run by local Chinese people, they can be found in many residential areas. Old-fashioned kapitiums are usually located at shop houses, and often have a quite run-down appearance. The term kedai kopi or warkop which stands for warung kopi is more often used. 
More recently, modern capitiums have emerged, and can be found in many shopping malls, particularly in big cities such as Jakarta, Maidan, Batam and Surabaya. These attract customers from various backgrounds. Coffee shop talk Coffee shop talk is a phrase used to describe gossip because it is often a familiar sight at Kopi TMs where a group of workers or senior citizens would linger over cups of coffee and exchange news and comments on various topics including national politics, office politics, TV dramas, sports and food. Example of typical capitium beverage terms Kopi O equals hot black coffee with sugar Kopi O Pung equals iced black coffee with sugar Kopi O Kosong equals hot black coffee unsweetened Kopi O Pung Kosong equals iced black coffee unsweetened Kopi equals coffee with condensed milk Kopi Pung iced coffee with condensed milk Kopi C – Hot coffee with evaporated milk, with sugar Kopi C – Kosong – Hot coffee with evaporated milk Kopi C – Pung – Iced coffee with evaporated milk, with sugar Kopi Stern – Iced coffee extra smooth Teho equals hot tea without milk, sweetened Teho Pung equals iced tea without milk, sweetened Teho Kosong equals hot tea without milk, unsweetened Teho kosong pung equals iced tea without milk, unsweetened. Teh equals tea with condensed milk, sweetened. Teh pung iced milk tea, sweetened. Tehc hot tea with evaporated milk, sweetened. Tehc kosong hot tea with evaporated milk, unsweetened. Tehc pung iced tea with evaporated milk, sweetened. Tiao he or tiao her Chinese tea. Tat kio Milo. Chom equals mixed of coffee and tea, sweetened. Chom pung equals iced version of chom, sweetened. Yin yang, yuan yang equals same as chom. Michael Jackson equals mixture of soy milk and grass jelly, black and white. Tai ga hao equals Horlicks means hello everyone. Equals. Topic: Explanation of capitium terms. Topic. Kopi Malay for coffee O, O equals Hokkien for black coffee, without milk tea. Pung equals Hokkien for iced Kosong equals Malay for zero, meaning without sugar and condensed milk C, C equals with evaporated milk Teh equals tea Tiao he or tiao her equals Hokkien for fishing reference to dipping up and down of tea bag. Tart kio equals Hokkien for kicking a ball, as retro Milo tins often feature a soccer player kicking a ball on their labels. Su tai equals fu chao or Cantonese for min tim or less sweet base, i.e. less sugar or sweet condensed milk added to the bottom of the cup. Ka tai equals fu chao for add sweet or Cantonese for ga tim or add base i.e. a sweeter beverage, with more sugar or condensed milk added. Pua co equals hokkien, means half hot, which gives you a drinkable, still warm kopi, tea. These terms may be used in different configurations to suit one's liking. If the stated term is in Mandarin, the pronunciation will be indicated in the Mandarin Hanyu pinyin spelling e.g. diao for diao or bing. For Bing. Otherwise, it will be indicated, as much as possible in the local pronunciation non-Hanyu pinyin romanization e.g. Kopi and not Gobi for cafe, Tiu and not Diu, Diao for Diao, Pung and not Bang for Bing for the interest of non-Mandarin Hanyu pinyin users. See also Punjabi Daba Malaysian cuisine Singaporean cuisine Hawker Centre Pasar Malam, Night Market 
Mamak stall Coffee shop Tea restaurant